officer bodyguard for him to say do live for do. To love first spouse to promise, serve, worship, and faithful best friend. That's forever this king of trying to pay him. Ephesians 16, 18. Finally, be strong, strong, strong in the love of the Lord and his power, power, power. Put on the form of God so that you can't take your stand against the devil's schemes and the sins out of lies. Stand firm with the belt of truth to the God's buckle around your waist. With the breastplate of righteousness in place, with the feet fitted, with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace, and dish all this, take up the shield of faith in it to God himself, but you can't take your stand against the flaming arrows out of the evil ones out of sin's lies. Take the helmet. Salvation is the sword of the Spirit of God, which is a true, true word of God, and pray in all occasions and all kinds of prayers, Ephesians 3, for this reason. The prisoner of Christ Jesus for the sake of you Gentiles who love and serve money and our sexual world to worship surely you have heard about the ministration of God God's grace that was given to me for you in the mystery mystery may know to me me by revelation so that you may understand the mystery of Christ which is made known known to people by the spirit of God's holy apostles apostles prophets prophets mysteries through the God the Gentiles who love and serve money or sexual world to worship. Safe through Christ Jesus, I became a righteous servant. And this gospel gift God God's grace given me through the working of His God's power, power, power. Now to Him, God God, who's able to minister more than we ask. Or mention according to His God's power, power, power. That is the work of me. God Himself is our bodyguard, point to Him. As we go through life here, so I'll make it to the eternal home with Him. Forever, amen, amen. love life and light and excuse me I still have severe massive allergies and I still have side effects from my coronavirus shot um, I talked to some people they said it took up to them two weeks to get over it anyway so excuse me I can barely sing so pardon me I might make this week short as long as you get this week's lesson <laughs>
Okay, everybody, pardon me. Like I said, I still don't feel good. I still have the side effects from the coronavirus shot. Um, and I still have severe allergies, really bad. I always get this time of year, so pardon me until whatever's blooming and the other stops blooming. So excuse me. Hey, close your eyes, close your eyes. Can I just get now back? What do you think about? To love first. Mind to think, say, and do to live for and by. It's where you're going to end on Jesus Christ's turn of judgment day to his faithful and righteous that love him first. Serve and worship him and live your life for unto him and say his true words and right choice for unto him. We'll have everlasting life with him in his kingdom. But the outer sins and liar to love the things and people here first to serve them and worship them, to say and do, to live for and by them, will end, die forever, and the dark steps forever, bind from them. Amen, amen. So remember that. God himself always, always, always comes first. Always. Excuse me. Okay, everybody. Hey. I'm Pastor Marshall Lewis Fish, where Plex Blesses Christ Jesus. It's the Lord's Supper Sunday. So happy and ready. It's supposed to only get in the 30s Tuesday and possibly snow. Okay. God himself is our bodyguard. Yes, he is. Amen. Born through him to say and do to live born through, to love first, vows to and promise, serve, worship, and faithful best friend that's forever in his kingdom eternal life with him. Amen. Ephesians 6, 10, 18. Finally be strong in the Lord and his power. Put on the former God so you can take your stand against the devil. So idle sins of lies comes at us all the time. Stand firm. Stand with the belt of truth of God's book around your waist. With the breastplate of righteousness in place and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace and dish to all this. Take up the shield of faith and into God himself, which you can't take your stand against flame and arrows. I want sins of lies that comes at us all the time. Take the helmet, helmet, helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit of God, which is the true words of God, and pray on all occasions with all kinds of prayers, Ephesians 6, 3, excuse me, excuse me. For this reason, I, Apostle Paul, the prisoner of Jesus Christ, for the sake of gen you Gentiles who love and serve money in our sexual world to worship them, surely you have heard about the ministration of God's grace that was given me for you. <clears throat> to make known to me by revelation so that you may understand the mystery of Christ which is made known to people by the Spirit of God's holy, holy, holy apostles and prophets this mystery is that through the gospel the Gentiles who live and serve money in our sexual world to worship them say through Jesus Christ I came a righteous servant of this gospel by the gift of God's grace given me through the working of his God's power now to him, God, God, who is able to immeasurably more than we ask or imagine according to you, he is God's power that is at work within me. God himself is our bodyguard going through him as we go through life here, so we'll make it to our eternal life with him in this kingdom and live forever. Amen. Okay, pardon me, excuse me. <coughs> like I said, I got bad allergies, so excuse me. Okay, now, do you have an expiration date on your life? Well, do you? You do if you love first the things and people to serve, worship, say, do, live for, and by them. You are near the expiration date, and on your expiration date, you'll end dying in the dark death forever by from them. And don't feel sorry for those who keep making their own, no, 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 mistakes, buying from their own, no, 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 wants and desires of the flesh. Who and what saying they crave less for more they never get enough of no or do, do, does it to make them happy or satisfy them the things and people to love first serve worship say and do to live for and by who and what saying there are ultra sinners and liars dying and darkness has them and they'll end dying in the dark step forever amen and my two words of God are valid because they are the two words of God himself. And most people love first serve worship the things and people belong to them. 
And therefore, by them is the best friend. They're like them that sing, out of sinners and liars. They are truly dying. Dark says them, though they die in the dark's death forever. But the few people that love God first, vow to and promise, serve, worship Him, and belong to God Himself, say His two words that lives in us, and do His right choices, born through Him, or righteous truth and spiritual. And he's our faithful best friend, and we're like Him who's unseen spiritual living, and His light shines in and on us. We'll live forever in His kingdom. Possessions and treasures, a real true home, and promise to love a life that's throughout eternity with God. Amen. <clears throat> And remember, we do not hate no one, no, we don't. We just do not like what they say and do. We love everyone in God's love through brother and sister love. In God, nor do we judge. Only He is the eternal judge. He will judge them on where they'll end. Between two is faithful and righteous, lives forever in His kingdom, eternal life. But to our sinners and liars, who loves first, serves, worships, and best friend, and belongs to the saved, to live for and by whom what sing. And this is their home, worldly ends, dies in the world's grave, darkest death for every man. Okay, now this word is valid, means legally or official, acceptable, an argument or point having sound basis in logic or fact, reason or cogent to the mind, reason, evidence. Okay, now, who what do you work for and have a relationship with first? It's to who what you love first, serve, worship, say you live for and by and dies forever by and for them. If you go by whom what's saying. But to all sinners and liars, ends dies forever. Amen. But if you love God first, serve, worship him, to say you do live for and through him. Your righteous truth and spiritual like him, see his two words are right choices with him. You'll live forever with him and his kingdom eternal life. Excuse me, I kinda messed up there. Okay, pardon me, I'm really hot. Should turn my air on. There's a lot of windows in this front room. Okay, now this week's Bible verse, Psalm 661. Shout for joy, Galatians 5, 22, 26, for the Spirit of God's love, peace, joy, etc. all the earth. Okay, now. As a counselor and pastor, when you marry, marry for and by the right reasons, not for and by the wrong ones, just to look good in God's eyes, or because they're lonely, or because you're lonely, or for sex less, who the person represents in bodily form as an object, formality, idol. Who the person is on the outside, or just because the person's rich, or the person's not committed, or it's a one-way relationship all about for one person, or the person's not there for you, or there's are secrets hiding things and people from each other. Or the person's not a Christian, but an outer sinner liar to love for their worship. The person will mislead you towards death and darkness. Then it's a fairy tale, fake type relationship. <clears throat> because you're lying to the person, but maybe because you love the person, but the person is on the inside. It's a two way relationship. You're both completely committed to each other, and therefore, each other. And be upfront and truthful about things. There's no secrets, lies, or hiding things or people. Because they'll come out sooner or later and you can lose the person by and from them. Amen there. <clears throat> and the person's a Christian. God himself comes first to love. Serve, worship, say, and do live for and do your best friend. And you're both about the same age, so you both can grow older together and have a lot in common. Then it's made for by the right reason. Okay, remember God's greatest and most important commands is, number one, love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul. With all your mind, with all your strength in Him, the second is, is love your neighbor, everyone as yourself, from God's love and brother and sister love. <clears throat> in Mark 12, 29, 31, and John 8, 34. Jesus Christ, I tell you the truth, everyone who sins, 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 is a slave to sin. Now a slave to sin, sin has no permanent place in God's family. No. Family of God will end, die forever. It's the same Jesus Christ set you free. You prayed and given them to his cross and let them die. You will be free indeed in Christ Jesus. Now rise and cross over from death and darkness, life, light in him. And you and better life, being reborn, purified, cleansed, and I let it born through him. <coughs> to that first serve, worship him. And faithful best friend to say his two words that lives in us in language. 
and do his right choice ways well, right to the spirit to be like him, belong to him as his righteous people, towards the permanent place with him and his family of eternal life in his kingdom. Amen. Yeah, are you, excuse me, pardon me, <clears throat> I got a tickle on my throat. I said I got allergies bad, so pardon me. Why do you rebels, rebels, rebels who are against God choose your own ones, desires of flesh that sing and crave us for more of them to love first, serve, worship, say, and do live for them by them and be long and you're like them and they're your best friend? You are truly dying and darkness has you for them by your own possessions and pleasures, the out of sin's lies. You truly end dying the darkness of death forever by them, but to those who are fallen through God himself, choose him. As our real true God, He's all we need. He feels us inside and truly makes us happy to love first. That's an undying love. Serve, worship, say, and do live one through Him. That's an undying life belong to Him and like Him. Righteous, true, spiritual, and faithful best friend living and have His light that shines in and on us. We'll live in His kingdom, eternal life, love life, and light with Him forever. Amen. Hey, I enjoy my freedom from sin, sin, and Al's lies. I pray and give them to Jesus Christ who died. I've crossed over from death and darkness, arose into Jesus Christ, life, light in Him, and been reborn, new, pure, cleansed. Now live forward through Him and His love, peace, joy, serve, peace, spirit, life, fight, joy, success in me. He fills me inside, truly makes me happy, satisfies me. He's all I need. <clears throat> Excuse me. And have learned His two words and language that lives in me to say and do His right choice, ways of will. And I follow Him. He's my leader. To love first, or worship, faithful best friend. A relationship work for him first. I'm just a stranger who passed through here for a short time. I totally belong to him and my home and treasures in this kingdom of eternal love, love and life forever with him and the strong and the strong faith in God and truth has gone from the world because most people choose the world's possession, pleasures whom was sane and belong to them. Their own ones are craving less for more and belong to I owe sins lies. They are dying darkness as them. To love first their worship, say do live for them by and like them. They'll end dying the world's dark death forever. But to the few, few, few who have strong faith in God's truth and choose him who's unseen belong to him, spiritual and living, and have his light to love first their worship. To say do live for and do right you spiritual like him, lives forever with God, this came with eternal life. Amen. Okay, now this sweet smiles, children's lessons for everyone. Excuse me. Wow, now I wish I'd turn my air on. The sun's hot in this front room. Is God. Now, when you think of God, He is the Holy Spirit who's unseen in the Holy Bible. He teaches us all about God and His Son, Jesus Christ, and how and who we're to live for and through to love Him first as love's true meaning he created love and life and the heavens earth us in the beginning just wanted to he even gave us our first breath of life here as we live our lives forth to him we're righteous truth and spiritual as we say his true words that lives in us and do his right choice ways well as he lives in us spiritually we serve him worship faithful best friend he fills us aside truly makes us happy all we need and when we sat down to talk with Mike, satisfies us, glorifies 26, God's love, be sure, etc. The true spirit lives in us. And he's our God, our Heavenly Father. And we put on the former God, Ephesians 6, 10, 18, from the flaming arrows of the evil ones. Out since life comes to us all the time, trusting God to us, Mrs. Jesus. John 4, 2, and Bay Bay's commands, decrees, and laws. And next 20, God's two commandments and greatest commands. Mark 12, 29, 31, to love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and, and with all our strength in God himself. To la, 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 la. Our neighbors, everyone as ourselves, to God's love and brother sister love as we live our lives as just strangers here passing through a short time and belong to God Himself. We're, we pray, giving Him our soul, sins, lies. We've loved, served, and worshiped to Jesus Christ. They have died completely, rose like Jesus did on Easter, and Christ Jesus, a new and better life, and crossed over death, dark, sins, life, light. In Him, we've been reborn, new, purified, cleansed to love. Sir, follow him. He's a leader, goes before us. His disciples, righteous people, tribe, Israelites, and say his two words do and lives in us and his right choices. So on this eternal judgment day, that's the way without the Bible, and when Jesus Christ or when Jesus Christ comes again at the end of time, 
that's mainly at the end of the Bible in the book of Revelations. We'll live forever with him. <clears throat> in his kingdom, or this new holy city, at the end of time when he comes again. But the other sin is the liars, those who love and worship, saying, do live for by him, was saying, will he die in the dark steps forever, or at the end of time, the lake of fire forever. The Holy Bible teaches us everything we need to know all about God himself and his truth. Amen. Okay, now it's time for the Lord's Supper. I take my own 1 Corinthians 11, 20, 26. Again, pardon me. My allergy is extreme. <clears throat> Whenever you eat this bread, Jesus' body, and drink the cup of grape juice, Jesus' body, blood, excuse me, you proclaim the Lord's death on the wood cross for our sins lives. We pray, given to Jesus Christ, have died completely. Cross over death, dark, life, light in Him, and been reborn and purified, cleansed. We live born through Him, right, true, spiritual, say His two words that lives in us, and do His right choice, ways well. To love first, serve, follow, He's our leader, goes before us to worship and faithful best friend. And belong to Him now, therefore, whenever you eat this bread, Jesus' body, drink the cup of grape juice, Jesus' blood, in another way. You haven't prayed and given your all since life to his cross. You still say and do them will be guilty, guilty of sin against Jesus. You'll end, die forever on his eternal judgment day. The person not to examine the person self doesn't sin, sin, sin anymore. Before taking the Lord's Supper without recognizing the body and blood of Jesus Christ, judgment on the person self. This is why many of you are weak and sick for you. Your all sins lies and none of your fathers. Jesus comes again at the end of time and lives with us righteous and faithful in his new holy city. They that are sins and liars will burn the lake fire with the world our sins and liars forever. For what I received from the Lord Jesus on the night, he was betrayed, took the bread and broke it and gave it thanks. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for your blood and body. Jesus said, take eat, take eat. This is my body given to your members to me in the same way. He took the cup of grape juice and said, take eat. This is my blood given to your members to me. The new covenant now bow your heads in prayer to Jesus and thank silence. Okay, now let's pray. The Lord's Prayer, Matthew 6, 9, 13, Luke 11, 2, 4. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us daily day bread. Forgive us our trespasses. Forgive those trespasses against us. And it's not temptation, but us from evil. But thy kingdom, power, and glory forever. Amen. Okay, everybody, get your holy Bibles out. Excuse me, I really wish I turned my head on. time of year, amen. Okay, everybody. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me for a second. words of David God God's faithful and righteous the article two words of David son of Jesse the article of the man exalted by the most high which is God himself the man the man excuse me anointed by the God of Jacob Israel's singer songs the spirit of the Lord spoke through me <clears throat> his two words was on my tongue the God of Israel spoke the rock of Israel said to me when one rules over people in righteousness, when he, the person rules the fear of the Lord, the person is like the light of the morning at sunshine, sunrise, on a cloudless morning, the beginning after rain, that, be, <clears throat> that brings the grass from the earth. Is not my house right with God? Has he not made with me an everlasting covenant, arrogance secured in every part? Will he now bring to foundation my salvation and grant me my every desire? But he will also allow your people's law to be cast aside like thorns, which are gathered with the hand. Whoever touches thorns, use the tool of iron and shaft of a spear. They are burned, burned, burned up. Where they lie, they will die forever. I don't know if he brought me that one. Okay, First Chronicles 29.10. 
David, God's faithful and righteous, praise God's love, O Lord, in the presence of the whole assembly, saying, Praise God's love to you, O Lord, God, God, our Father Israel, God's righteous and faithful people, from everlasting to lasting years, O Lord, is the greatness of the power and the glory and majesty and the splendor for everything in heaven and on earth is yours. Yours, O Lord, is the kingdom to exalt head over all. Wealth and honor comes from you. You are the ruler of all things, in your hands the strength and power to exalt give strength to everyone. Now, O oh God, we give you thanks and praise God's love, your glorious name. Amen, amen. <coughs> Okay, pardon me. <clears throat> He's giving me a lot of Bible verses. Pardon me, I'm going to turn the air on. I'm sorry, but excuse me, but it's hot in this front room. Pardon me, i got to turn my air on. It'll just take a second. Pardon me, I had to turn my air on. It's really hot in this front room. With all these windows and stuff. Okay, pardon me. Send cross 36, 15 and 16. God of our fathers sent word to you through his messengers again and again because he had pity on his people and on his dwelling place but you my 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 God's messenger despite his two words and scoffed at his prophets until the wrath anger of the Lord aroused against his people and there was no remedy amen amen the elder sinners and liars are dying Amen, amen. Okay, Ezra 9 1. Do not intermarriage other tribe, people, nations. Become like them, altar sinners and liars, instead of God's righteous tribe, people, which is against God Himself. Amen, amen. Don't forget that. Okay, everybody, pardon me here. He's giving me a lot of Bible verses. Shall we keep some good ones? Isaiah 22, 2, or Isaiah 2, 22, stop trusting in a person who has a better breath in their nostril, where you will die forever by and from them to love, serve, and worship them. Amen, amen. You got to trust in God. Love, serve, and worship Him. Amen there. Pardon me. Go to Isaiah 34. Pardon me. Come near, you nations, and listen. Pay attention, you people. The earth here and all that is in it, the world and all that comes out of it. The Lord is angry with all nations. <clears throat> His anger is upon the armies, out of the sinners and liars. He will totally destroy them. He will give them over to slaughter, die forever. Their slain be thrown out. <clears throat> thrown out, their dead bodies will be sent up a stench. The mountains will be soaked with their blood. All the stars of the heavens will be dissolved, and the sky rolled up like a scroll, a stray host fall, like wither leaves, the vine, like shrub figs from the tree. My sword has drunk its fill in the heavens. See the descendants of judgment where you will live. The people have totally destroyed. The sword of the Lord is bathed in blood by and from the of sin's lies. It is covered with fat. <clears throat> the blood of the lamb goes from rams. For the Lord is a sacrifice and the great slaughter. The wild ox fall and them great bulls. And the dust soak of them. The Lord has a day of vengeance, <coughs> a reputation to oppose on Mount Zion. It's cause Edom's streams will turn to the plant of the dust, burn sulfur, become blazing, quench night and day. Its smoke will rise forever from generation to generation, will lie desolate. No one will ever pass through it again. The desert owls will possess it, the great owl and the raven will rest there. God will stretch over the hidden where you live, the mess of the land plan to line desolation, there to be called a kingdom, and all her princes, rulers will vanish away, dies forever. Thorns will run her cadaveros, 
members for strongholds. She will become haunted jackals, home of owls, desert creatures, hyenas, wabbies, blank, lead to each other. Night creatures will also repose and find themselves a place to rest. The owl will nest and lay her eggs. She has them and care for her young under the shadows of her wing. There are also the falcons will gather each to its mate, look to scroll the Lord and read. None of these will be missing, no more like her mate. For it is his mouth who has given the order. His spirit will gather them together. He loads their portions. His hands distributes them by measure. They will possess it forever and dwell there generation, generation. And many men. I don't know, he brought me that one. Pardon me, I ain't thirsty. Isaiah 49. God's righteous. Listen to me, you islands. Hear this, you distant lands. Before I was born, the Lord called me. For my birth, he had mentioned my name. <clears throat> he had my mouth like a sharp sword. In the shadows of his hand, he hid me. He made me into a polished arrow and concealed me in his quiver. He said to me, you are my righteous servant. Israel, God's righteous and faithful, whom I will display my splendor. But I said, I had or no purpose. I have a spend no strength in vain for nothing. It was due me, the Lord's hand. And my reward is eternal life in God's kingdom is with my God. And now the Lord says, he who formed me in the womb to be his righteous servant, bring Jacob back to him and to gather Israel to himself, God's righteous people. For I am on in the lives of the Lord. My God has been my strength. He said it's too small for thank you to be my, my righteous servant to restore the tribes of Jacob and bring back the Israel I have kept. I will also make a lie out of GHT, the Gentiles who love and serve money and are such immoral that you may bring my salvation to the ends of the earth. <clears throat> That's what the Lord says. The Redeemer saved the whole one Israel to whom he has despite all adorned by the nations in the servant of rulers. King rulers, I will make you and rise up. Proceed, bow down. Because the Lord who is faithful. Amen. The whole one Israel has chosen you. <clears throat> This is what the Lord says in time of my favor. I will answer in the day of salvation. I will help you. I will keep you and make you to be a cup promise for the people to restore the land, land, land and receive the desolate inheritance to say to captive, come out and those in darkness, all sinners and liars, be free for and through God. They will feed beside the roads, find pasture on every barren hill. They will neither hunger nor thirst. Desert sun will beat, no, no beat on them. He who have compassion on them will guide them and lead them beside springs of water. I will turn my mountain to roads and my highways will be raised up. See, see, my highway will be raised up. See, they will come from afar, some from the north, some from the west, some from the region of all nations. And shout for joy, Galatians 5, 20, the God's love, joy, O heavens. Rejoice, the world, verse 2, song of mountains, for the Lord's comfort his righteous people. And will have compassion on his afflicted ones. The Zion said, The Lord has forsaken me. The Lord has forgotten me. Can a mother forget the baby at her breast or compassion on her child she is born? Though she may forget, I will not forget you. See, I have engraved you on the palm of my, my hands. Your walls are before me. Your son's children hasten back. And those who laid you, you waste, depart from you. Lift up your eyes and look around. All your children gather and come to you. As surely as I live, declares the Lord. You will wear them as an ornament. You will put them in like a bride, though you were ruined and made desolate, and your land laid waste, and you will be too small for your people. Excuse me. And those who de devoured you would be far away. The children born in your raven would say in your hearing, this place is too small for us. Give us a place to live. Save the heart before these things. I was excited to reject who brought these up. I was left alone there. Where have they come from? This is what the Lord says, see? I will reckon the Gentiles who love and serve money are such immortal. I will lift up my banners to this people. They will bring your sons in their arms and carry your daughters on their shoulders. 
king's rulers would be your foster fathers and their wives, your nursing mothers, they will bow down before you with their face to the ground. They will lift the dust at your feet, and you will know that I am the Lord. Those who hope in me, me, will not be disappointed, and can a plan be taken from warriors, or captive rescued from the fierce. But this is what the Lord says. Yes, captives will be taken from warriors, and plunder from the fierce. I will contend with those who contend with you, and your children I will say, I will make you oppressors of their own flesh eat their own flesh, they will be drunk on their own blood as with wine. Then all mankind, everyone will know that I am the Lord your Savior, your Redeemer, mighty one of Jacob. Amen, amen. Isaiah 59. Um, pardon me, he's giving me a lot of Bible verses. Pardon me, I am really thirsty. Jeremiah, excuse me. Jeremiah 2.20 No, no, you broke off your yoke and tore off your bonds to God. Yes, you did. You said, I will not serve you. Indeed, on every hill and under every spread tree, you lay as a prostitute, I will turn a liar. I will plant you like a choice vine of a sound and reliable stock. How then did you turn against me? Into corrupt wild vine, I'll send lies. Although you wash yourself with soda and use a bunch of soap to stain your unclean, unclean, have your guilt is still before me, says the Lord God. <clears throat> How can you say I am not defiled? I have not run after the bells, I'll send lies. See how you behaved in the valley where you live. Consider what you have done. You are a swift sheep camel running here and there, or a wild donkey accustomed to the desert, sniffing the wind and her craving in her heat. Who can restrain her? Any male restrain her, tire themselves, or her feet bare, dry. But you said it is no use. I love born gods, I don't sense lies, and I must go after them. As a chief disgrace when he is caught, so the house of Israel disgrace where you live. They, their rulers, and their officials, their priests, and their prophets, they say to wood, money, buildings, etc., you are my father, and to stone, you gave me birth. They have turned their backs on me, 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 and not their faces. Yet when they are in the trouble, they say, Come and save us. Where then is God all sins lies you made for yourselves? Let them come if they can save you. When you are in trouble. For you have as many gods all sins lies as you do towns. Yes, you do. Oh, Judah, where you live. Why do you bring charge against me? You have all rebelled against me, declares the Lord. <clears throat> In vain I punished your people. They did not respond to correction. Your words are observing your prophets like a ravening lion. Excuse me. You of this generation consider the word of the Lord. I have been a desert to Israel, a land of great darkness. Why do my people say we are free to roam? We will come to you no more. Does a maid forget her jewelry, a bribe, her wedding, or ornaments? Yet yeah, my people have forgotten my days without number. How skilled you are at pursuing love, even the worst of women people can learn from your way, your own ways, or your clothes. Men people find their life love is poor, though you do not catch them breaking in. In spite of this, you say I am innocent. He is not angry with me, but I will pass judgment on you because you say I have not sinned, sinned, sinned. Why do you go about so much charge, excuse me, charging your own ways? You will be disappointed by Egypt where you live as you were before. You will also leave that place with your hands on your head. For the Lord has rejected those you trust in to love, serve, and worship the things of people. 
Be you wanna, you will not be held by them. Amen, amen. I don't know. He brought me that one. Okay, everybody. Pardon me. He's giving me a lot of Bible verses, so pardon me here. Need to find this week's. Okay, Ephesians three. It's getting dark again. Sam can't make up his mind. Wants to stay out of one class. She brought my uh, lamp in here now. For this reason, I, Apostle Paul, prisoner of Jesus Christ, for the sake of you Gentiles, the love of ceremony in our section moral to worship them. Surely you have heard about the ministration of God. God's grace was given to me for you. The mystery made known to me, me <clears throat> by revelation, and I already read briefly in reading this, then you will be able to understand my delight in the mystery of Christ which was not made known to people in other generations as it has now been revealed by the Spirit of God's holy, holy, holy apostles, apostles, prophets, prophets. This mystery is through the gospel. The Gentiles who love us are money or sexual moral are heirs together with the Israel, God's righteous members together, one body through Christ Jesus and share together in the promise of Jesus Christ. I became a servant of this gospel by the gift of God's grace given me through the working of his power, though I am less than God's people. Grace given me to preach Gentiles, the of minor or sexual, moral, and searchable riches of Christ, and to make plain to everyone the administration of this mystery, which <clears throat> for ages past, past, was kept hidden in God, who created all things, his intent, was that now through the church the manifold wisdom of God of God, God God's children may be known the rulers and authorities and having realms according to his excuse me I underline this a lot purpose which he administered in Christ Jesus the Lord Jesus and his to his faith in him we may approach God God with freedom <coughs> excuse me in confidence, I ask you, therefore, not to be discouraged because of my suffering for you, which are my glory. <clears throat> Excuse me. For this reason, I kneel before the Father God, from whom his whole family in heaven and on earth derives his name. I pray out of his glorious riches. He may strengthen you with power, power, power through His Spirit in your inner being, inner being, so that Christ may dwell in your heart, God's love, through faith in Him. And I pray that you, being rooted, rooted, and established in the love, God's love, may have power, power, power together with all the saints, God's righteous, to grasp how wide, how long, how high, deep the love of Christ is, and to know He this love that surpasses knowledge of God's uh, may be filled to the measure of all fullness of God. Now to him who is able to do immeasurable more than we ask imagine according to his power and the work within me. That is the work within us to him glory in the church of Jesus Christ through our generations forever and ever. Amen. Okay and that was Ephesians 3, now we need Ephesians 16, 18. Pardon me, I am thirsty. Finally be strong in the Lord and His power. Put on the former God, 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 God. So you can take your stand against the devil's schemes, out of sin's lies, struggles not against the flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against authorities, against the powers of this dark world, all sin's lies, and against the spiritual for the evil in the heavenly realms. Therefore, put on the former God, so that when the day comes, out of sin's lies, you may be able to take your ground. And after you have done everything to stand, stand then with the belt of truth of God's buckle around your waist with the breastplate of righteousness in place and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace and dish to all this take up the shield of faith in God but you can't extinguish all the flame and arrows of the evil and all sins lights come to us all the time take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit of God which is the word of God 
appreciate you reaching out to us. And pray in the spirit on all occasions. And if you'd like to be our friend, just like Bonnie, with all kinds of prayers and requests with this in my mind. Be alert and always keep on praying for those saints righteous. Pray for me. That when I open my mouth, words may be given to me that I may be fearlessly known the mystery of the gospel, the mystery of the gospel for which I'm an ambassador in chains. Pray, may be clear fearlessly as I should. Faithful, uh, excuse me, Tyrus, the dear brother, faithful servant of the Lord, tells you everything to that you may know how I am and what I am doing. I'm sending him to you for this very purpose that you may know that we are. We may encourage you. Peace to the brothers and sisters, love with faith. From God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ, grace to the Lord Jesus Christ with an undying love. We love Jesus Christ with an undying love. Amen, amen. Man, his love is undying. God love you first. Okay, he's giving me a lot of verses. Pardon me here. Okay, um. Number one, always remember this. God himself always comes first, always. To love, spouse. Revelation 2, 4, Isaiah 54, 5, and Jeremiah 3, 4, to vows to and promise. That's an undying love. To serve, worship, faithful, best friend, master. Luke 16, 13, 16. And provide with the rain and plants to eat and drink. He takes care of us, his righteous people, tribe, his righteous children, to say and speak his two words and language that lives in us and do Right choice is one to him, ways and will. God himself lives in us spiritually. He, he's greater. John 4, 4, 5, he lives in us and feels us inside. Christ makes us happy. He's open, he satisfies us through spiritual life, right choice, of God, let me show etc. We prayed and given our all sins, lives to Jesus Christ, they've died completely. We've crossed over from darkness and death and rose in his life, light in him, been reborn and purified, cleansed, and lived on through him. To love first, serve, follow, say, and do to live for and by and obey his current commands. Decrease the laws, belong to him, trust in God, trust us and meet Jesus for John 14, 1. And co relying upon depending on control of us, he takes care of us as is righteous. And put on the former God, Ephesians 6, 10, 18. <coughs> Excuse me. I got took on my throat. From the fame and error that you want out since lights comes at us all the time. We have strong faith in God himself. He has his righteous and faithful and live as strangers here. Just pass through it for a short time. We belong in our home treasures in God's kingdom and promise to live a life spare with him. Number two, come to your spouse and yourself. Number three, come to work four to five hours a week. Number four, come to your friends, my own person, my organization, preach gospel. Of the Holy Bible, God's truth and kingdom of eternal life and help save and guide his righteous people home in his kingdom. Number two is help people. Number three is help make our community and state a better, safe one to live. I've emailed the governor, pure and he's pure in some issues, and I'm adopted my neighborhood to keep it clean from trash debris. I pick up trash and keep it, and help keep it a nice and peaceful one. I'm ordained pastor, so if you need my services, prayers, or have ideas, for our community, you can email me, and truck us are watching my sermons on the Wi-Fi. And if West Peoria has a 4th of July parade during the coronavirus, I'll be in it. And you can't donate Bibles, go on lovepackages.org or we'll send them. And I have colored hearts on my front windows, on my house, on my car's back windows for support, support in our community during the coronavirus. And on my three-level apartment house, me and my son will be working on the backyard. And I want to thank area business restaurants. Carriers in our fire, police departments, rescuers, pastors, organizations, except for which do for our community that reflects my mental and physical social health that always out there. During the coronavirus on the government's restrictions, tier one, phase four, they're open Monday through Friday, 5 a.m., 7 p.m., Saturday, 7 a.m. to noon, Sunday, closed. For members only, and masks are to be worn all the time except in the pools. The regular therapy and lap pools are open. You have to reserve the lap pool. I had a good workout in the therapy pool yesterday since there was a swimming class in the regular pool. And Peoria's parts of recreation for let me sing on the riverfront, sometimes on Sundays at 2 p.m. weather permits and there's no events <clears throat> or at the reception hall that's at the main entrance way. I don't know until I get there, so excuse me when there is. I'll let you know when I'm there. Thanks to God bless you for them.
Okay, now help during the coronavirus. She can get a vaccine for 16 years old and older. And they've canceled the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. It's only 60% effective and some people um, got blood clots from it and affordable health care. Go on healthcare.gov and an extra $300 in employment a week until September 6th. Go on FEMA side to apply. And forgiveness loans to small business organizations hurt by the pandemic. And a small business paycheck protection program and a small business loans on PPP side to apply a coronavirus AIDS Act error. Coronavirus Aid Cares Act funding for rental assistance on lie heaps side to apply and help on electric bills. On your mortgage holder, you can't get forbearance and help for three months and I think they're still taking that applications on the ARPS HARPS replacement program 2020 or refinance your mortgage the interest is low right now these help lower your mortgage every month or buy a home through a mortgage holder the interest is low right now these are the ones I know about okay now on your site this site can download some of my songs I pray and sing pray and sing I pray and sing and preach and sing every week and try to write a new song. I had two new songs, but I can't find them on my phone. Excuse me. And for donations and teas and offerings, give to the Lord. We are to give a tenth of our money to the Lord. Or you are robbing God and under his curse in Deuteronomy 14, 20, 23, and Malachi 3, 8, 9. Thanks, God bless you. Do donate. Okay, now let's pray. Lord God. You are a faithful God, creator. Without you, there'd be no existence, just darkness everywhere. You are our purpose and reason, and we love you first. As love's true meaning, that's an undying life, vows to and promise, spouse, and servant, worship, and faithful best friend. And we live for unto you, righteous, truthful, and spiritual. We're like you to say and speak your true words that listen us in your right choice, ways, and will. Lord God, we are your righteous people, tribe is righteous children, and we put on the former God and trust in you. We totally belong to you. You are all we need. You fill us aside, truly make us happy. We obey, obey your commands, laws, decrees, Lord God. We prayed and given Jesus Christ our sins, our lives to his cross. They've died completely. We crossed over in death and darkness and rose into his life and light. In him, been reborn and purified, cleansed. Now live born through him, say and do his true and words and right choices now. And for the coronavirus in the United States, 31.6 million cases and 566,000 deaths for them and their families and other countries and victims. For the publisher, your books I've written for you that'll be for sale in the market soon. And for the book I'm writing and songs and organizations in your hands, Lord God. And for the protesters and writers, there'll be peace and get along with each other as an equal. For Mark, Joseph, George, Dan, Pastor Dice, and me, and Anthony have health problems. Rebecca, Robin, Austin, Heather, John, Mike, Don, Ron, Jesse, Don and his girlfriend, 25, 26 year old daughters, are going through something personal. Lord God, protect us as your righteous people and for the shut ins. Doctors, nurses, deliverers, business, restaurants, fire police departments, ambulance, passed away. For the families, unemployed, bankrupt, homeless, sick and in pain, veteran soldiers, carrying new president, rulers of our state and cities, teachers, students, operational electric resolve. And Lord God, we pay to you in the morning. And meals and I and thanks to you and for the rain and plans you provide for us to drink and eat and for your breath of life and air that lives in us and keeps us alive in you. Oh Lord God, that's forever with you in your kingdom treasure home where which we belong and love and life forever. Amen. Okay, now be ready for Jesus eternal judge, faith, truth, and kingdom's now and the end of all things people's near. First Peter four seven and the thanks people from the Holy Bible still is in today's world and God's fire candle let. Emmanuel means God's with us and God bless America and God we trust one nation and God. God's temple is to be built in us through his true words and spirit that lives in us to say and do to live for and do. Him righteous to spiritually were like him that's forever with him in his kingdom to life. Not by and from whom would sing things, people, or money to say and do live for and by them. And like them, you end die in the dark death forever. And as right faithful truly building up, planting God's foundation for unto him. God's righteous people, tribe, children, Israelites, they'll be completely united together with him as we still live forever with him. And remember who would sing, sing, sing is temporary to say and do live for and by.
and you're like them. You ain't dying the dark's death forever, but who's unseen, God himself spiritual is permanent. To say his two words that lives in us and do his right choice, ways and will, and live born through him. Remember, you're righteous, we're righteous, truth and spiritual. We're like God. It's forever with him and his kingdom eternal life. Okay, now ask yourself, can the God, God, God idol sin lie that you use here that sing to say and do live for him by create the heavens or thus or give you everlasting life? No. They'll only die forever by for them. Only God, God himself is the true God, creator of heaven and earth us, who's unseen spiritual, to say and do live for him through him is an everlasting life in this kingdom. Amen. Okay, now, if I were my Kenny Cross, sing another song. Thanks, God bless. Have a nice, peaceful weekend. Pardon me. I'm still not totally feeling good. I still have severe allergies, and I still have the side effects from my coronavirus shot, so excuse me. If anything comes up during the coronavirus, I'll free all let you know. And I heard, too, uh, the coronavirus is going up in our community, too. Um, so, anyway, it's very important to get the shot. Amen. It's better to have the shot if you had the mild side effects. That's a big F. Um, they're just mild. And, um, and it's better to get the coronavirus and take a chance on dying from it. So, remember that. Um, anyway, thank you and God bless you. Have a nice, peaceful week. Excuse me, my camera cord is about ready to shut off, so i got to make this fast, okay? God himself is our bodyguard, foreign through him, to say and do his two words and right choice, the ways of will foreign through him, to live for him through him, be right to spiritual like him, to love first, vows to promise, serve, worship, and he's our faithful best friend that's forever with him in his kingdom eternal life. Amen. Remember that. Okay, if it shuts off, I apologize. It's about ready to shut off. So if it does, I apologize. God is the truth. God is the truth.
everybody shut up. So anyway, thank you and God bless you. Have a nice peaceful the rest of the weekend. Pardon me, I have severe allergies. And I still have the mild side effects um, from the coronavirus shot. So anyway, um, mainly I still got severe allergies. I'm allergic to something in the air. I don't know what it is. Anyway, um, hopefully it'll stop blooming here pretty soon. Anyway, thank you and God bless you. Have a nice, peaceful week. Thanks.